This is light panel. And it's all the best things about light block made in panelized form. We tweaked it to be a little bit more special. So let me explain. First up, these are so, so much bigger than your ordinary hollow block. So these come in panelized form. So imagine a size of a full plywood. You cut that vertically in half, and that is essentially the size of one light panel. What that gives you is it makes it so, so much faster to install on site. But the beauty of this and how we tweaked it is it comes in sandwich panel format. Basically, it has an outer skin, top and bottom, of a cement board, helping you prevent cracking on your walls and making your walls super, super flat. So, yun yung gusto natin, di ba? As flat and as skinny as possible. Next up, inside is what actually makes this so much special. This is the light block core. We made it even lighter to the point wherein this floats on water. And this gives you all the advantages of lightweight concrete without the usual disadvantages. So this is where our invention and our patents come from. Itong core na to is made out of pure concrete. Now there are a lot of other lightweight concrete products in the market, but that has mga foreign mixes like styrofoam or mga limestone. Ito talaga is pure concrete, meaning you get all the performance of regular concrete, just made lighter. But is it really faster, stronger, and more importantly, cheaper? That's our video for today. How can a modern day entrepreneur run a business on the go? with Odoo. An all-in-one management software with over 70 plus apps to meet all your business needs. From back-end management like customer relations, sales, inventory, and accounting to front-end interactions like building your own website. All the apps seamlessly integrate into one another for a hassle-free experience. So I can check how everything is going while I'm in the car, walking over to my next meeting, or when I get the chance to settle down at one of my desks. And as an older millennial like myself who likes things simpler, no coding knowledge is required when using this system. The database is ready to use. And if over 70 apps are a little bit overwhelming for you, no worries, just install the apps that you need. You can get all of them for the price of one with no function limits. Odoo, unleash your business potential today. Start a free trial and book a demo with their experts. Link in the description below. Okay, on this side we have Team Hollow Block and on the other side we have Team Light Panel. Let's see who can build a wall faster. So we have our time lapse camera running over here. Everything is uncut para makita natin kung sino talaga mas mabilis. But just by easily looking at it, one panel is about 18 pieces of hollow block. So imagine on site the practical aspect na kunin yan ng dalawang tao lang kaya nilang buhatin and for 18 hollow blocks they would have to go back and forth multiple times to get it on site. Not to mention the added cement and sand and rebars that are needed for hollow block. Ito, this side will only need adhesive which he is mixing right now. So on this side, we are doing the light panel. What they're doing now is using this adhesive. We have our own adhesive. And then we're just going to be placing the panels right there. Parang ito, nakalego lang talaga. Lagay, pin, adhesive, then lagay na naman ng bagong panel. So that's kind of like the whole process of light panel. We'll show details as we go along. So we can see here, 
Dalawang tao lang kaya na nila to mobilize it on site and lift it up. That's uh, really the beauty of lightweight concrete. So right now, all they're doing is making sure that it is as flush to the wall as possible. And then they'll make sure that it is straight and level. And then they're just going to pin it. Okay, so tingnan natin kung nasan na si Hollow Block. So, they're doing um, the rebar since this is just a demo. Hindi na kami naglagay ng epoxy. Ideally, meron pa yun po epoxy na ilalagay to make the rebars fit really, really well. So, Team Hollow Block right now is mixing the sand and cement to lay the groundwork for the hollow blocks. Dito naman, sa kabila, they've already installed one panel. All they have to do now is make sure it's plumb and level and they're gonna pin it with this one. How we keep this in place so that it doesn't slide around during earthquakes, during typhoons is we're gonna drill a hole here and pin this into place. Ito yung kakapit. Nakastudy din to lahat. Meron tayong makapal na libro of tests all about light panels. See, so and they've laid the first hollow block pa. The problem with hollow block is hindi yun perfectly the same yung dimension all the time of the hollow block. And when you lay it, nagtabingi ng konte and moves around. So you don't get as flat of a wall as possible. So that's why you need to do the plastering side and make sure that it's done right. Pag dito naman sa light panel, since meron na tayong cement board dito sa face ng ng panel natin, you can get a very, very flat wall. So, this one helps with that and also helps mitigate yung mga micro-cracking when it comes to just regular movement of any structure. So, Kuya Undoy is just doing a pin again on the top portion. Alam namin that this is fairly new compared to Hollow Block, but sa atin, if you order from us, order from us. All of the things that I'm mentioning right now, we have a specific team to make sure that you're successful in using our product. So what we're doing right now is just checking the bubble, making sure everything is aligned. So just a few knocks on the panels to make sure it is as straight as possible. And when we connect panels, meron din tong mga rebar na pin. That's just for added safety for your shear reinforcements. If you're interested in those studies, you can contact us. I'll put details down below para mas ma-explain ng maayos. So ito yun, that's uh, the biggest issue of hollow block is that you have to keep on filling these voids up. And one other issue when it comes to hollow block, after a few layers, maybe four or five layers, kailangan mo mag-stop because the mortar is still wet. If you keep on making it higher and higher, the wall will slowly sag to one side or the other. So, si Hollow Block, maybe one, two, three, tapos na. Now, this part, they're now finished with the first panel and they're adding the adhesive for the second panel. This is already aligned. This is already to accept skim coating and painting. Ito talaga. Derecho, automatic. So, itong si light panel again, this has been 10 years of R&D and something that we've been very, very passionate about. Just ever evolving, fully Filipino invention talaga to. We haven't seen any of this outside of the Philippines, at least not to my knowledge. So ito, they're just using a pipe to make sure it's as flush to the other panel as much as possible. All you have to do to attach the next panel to the other is add a pin on top and just nailing it in. Kumakapit talaga siya sa rebar na very very sturdy and I think that's something to do with the pure concrete core na in-innovate natin. So from the top, meron din tayong sa baba which na-attach sa niya. So it kind of looks like this and it gives um, stability to the whole system especially while we're waiting for the adhesive to cure. Well, we've installed two panels already. This side is doing two layers. And then you put a rebar na naman, and then you have to tie it up to make sure that everything is attached together. Ang laki talaga ng difference. Especially even this one is walang masyadong howling na nangyayari. But imagine if this was a high-rise building or even a house where you have to get that up to the level that you want. Yes, definitely mas mabigat to carry 
light panel versus a couple of hollow blocks, but you do it all in one go versus this one where you have to go back and forth, up and down. And ito pa, check out the site. This is what happens to your site as well. Ang daming mga broken na mga hollow blocks na mag magyayari, but you also have to deal with the mess. If you were to look at the light panel side, ito lang, <laughs> a mixing tray for the adhesive, but other than that, parang walang sagabal. So it's been about 30-35 minutes. We're doing the last panel na lang just for the demo. Uh, this whole three panels is about 4.5 more or less square meters installed in that amount of time. So considering na si Halo Block is about one square meter, hindi pa tapos, this is easily four times, at the very least, four times faster than Halo Blocks. So I guess this is the end of the challenge, we'll call it a day. This was done in about 40 minutes. Completo na lahat, and this is fairly flat already. And then seal na lang ng joints, and then skim coat, and then ready for painting. Now, the accomplishment naman of hollow block, this is about one plus square meters. The problem is, hindi pa to filled. Wala pa tong laman dito. Essentially, nahita natin na medyo tabingi tabingi yung hollow blocks, diba? So that's why plastering has to be done. Now, when you plaster, there's another level of complications there. Kung wavy ba ang plaster or not, it's just a lot of effort and a lot of work. So, isa din to sa mga reasons why on site there's a lot of wasted hollow block na makikita natin. We'll ju just do a simple drop test. Papakita natin kung how hollow block performs versus light panel. <laughs> We're not saying light panel is invincible, but ang maganda sa panel is if it cracks, pwede nating pagdugtong ulit and magagamit siya ulit. That's a very clear demonstration of the durability side. One panel, one whole panel is about 2,000 pesos. That's equivalent to 18 hollow blocks. Now, one hollow block is about 20 pesos lang. So when you multiply 18 times 20, it's 360 versus 2,000. Mukha pa rin mas mahal si light panel. But if you take everything as a whole, considering that hollow block needs mortar, needs cement, needs rebar, needs plastering, and all these other mobilization, makikita natin that light panel eventually becomes more cost effective. Plus, you add on the time saving. So we have one project here where isang bahay, ginawa nila using hollow block, 2.5 months natapos nila yung wall. Sa amin, using light panel, we were able to complete it in three weeks. Just the overhead cost of that and the time schedule cost of that already adds up to a lot of savings. Especially when you consider, kung wala pang wall, hindi ka makagawa ng electrical, yung mga plumbing natin, you can't install doors, you can't install windows, you can't paint. Um, everything in the schedule depends on the wall and it makes much more sense to use light panel. If you really want details, especially when it comes to the cost, you can give us a call in the numbers and the links below and we'll be sure to show you the proper computation on why we feel light panel is more cost effective. All right, guys, that's it. Thank you so much for sticking to the end of the video. This is something that I've been working on for 10 years and something that I feel truly, truly passionate about and I'm glad to be able to share it with you. Ito talaga is a lot of heartaches, a lot of sleepless nights, but it's been all worth it in the end. Subscribe, I hope you like this video and I'll see you later.